everyone? How's everyone doing today? Hope everyone's doing well. So I have not left my apartment for about seven days, which is like a full week. So this is the first time I left um, in one week. I kind of forgotten what I did, but anyway, I have to actually venture it outside and get some supplies because it's getting thin <laughs> in the fridge department. So I ran out of vitamin B5 as well, so I bought these $12 at the chemist warehouse. Uh, mainly this one is just for sleep, like I just have to make sure I go to sleep and stay asleep. I went to Aldi's next and I spent a little bit more time than I wanted to, mainly because I really needed a lot of supply but also at the same time it's not that I just wanted to see all the specials that they have because apparently on Wednesday they have specials right so I, it just happened that today is Wednesday so I got in at the right time my mental health has been in decline Especially the past week or so, I, I don't know why is it, I feel like is it diet because I've been eating well actually. So we are starting the Wednesday specials here because it's in the middle of the shop. I think if you go to any Aldi's in Australia, you can just see what they have. So this week special apparently is gardening because they have a lot of gardening stuff here. I was really tempted to buy the fern but I remember every time I buy fern I always end up having it dead within the next month or so. So I didn't. I refused the temptation. They have this button mushroom growing kit. Can you believe it? Like my god free mushroom but it's quite um heavy though i tried to lift it up but it didn't really lift high pressure attachment this is really good to clean your uh, balcony i feel like i am an infomercial right now but legit i was so excited like when i see all these specials also if you're a mommy you can get this reusable pot nappy from aldi and the thing is right like you think like all this um specials on Wednesday are low quality ones they're not they just I think either excess stock or like stuff that are no longer in season so they are actually just uh, regular stuff that you buy outside like outside Aldi in the regular retail shop like in department stores and stuff it's just that you know those excess stuff come to Aldi and they will get discounted so you actually do get a bargain well that's my theory anyway so far it works um this one actually costs a lot <coughs> i was so tempted to buy this but it was so heavy i could not lift it up i wanted this because i needed it to kind of like prevent pigeons to poke on my um, veggie patch like or whatever left of it so look how many seeds they have oh my god i was really tempted to buy this but I basically just gave away 90% of my gardening stuff so that the pigeons can't just stay on my balcony and poops all day. I only have like four uh, pots of plants left, mainly just soil and they don't have any plants in it. So I was so really tempted to buy these and kind of like start over my gardening stuff. But that means like I would have to just keep uh, fighting with the pigeons. So I had second thoughts. Oh, this is passion fruit fl um, plants. I've never seen it before. I've never seen a passion fruit um, plants before. There are so many varieties. Like today on Al at Aldi's, I was so tempted. I was like, why are you doing this to me? These are so beautiful. And also, every time I buy these little ones, they're all dead. They're always dead. I don't know why. Anyway my excitement is over <laughs> i was really excited over those gardening stuff to be honest also this rice things um they didn't have the rice that i wanted because i think we did once a review of the you know the what is it called the fried rice with egg um i didn't buy that one because i couldn't see any and i wanted to get one but i ended up buying this instead the super blend this is just more of Wednesday specials at Aldi's, like seriously, I was so tempted. 
I was so broke I couldn't buy anything um, but at the same time I feel lucky that I, I'm broke because I feel like if I have lots and lots of money I probably would end up lots and lots of fees um, I was actually after a fast food from Aldi they're actually pretty good um, I have these and these were my staple last year what was it last year yeah last year when we had that um, lockdown so it was pretty good also wanted some batteries they had like this $15 battery about a month ago but I couldn't find it today anyway going to Woolies next I didn't stay at Woolies for too long actually I was really there just for a few minutes Ugh. but look at these guys there is a reduced supply of leafy greens and I think the price is so high nowadays I don't know I don't think I can afford vegetables anymore it's um, it's stressful everything is so high like I just basically trying to nick off any meat or protein that is look affordable at this point because I feel like the prices is gonna go up really high especially the inflation so I ended up buying the Thai uh, green curry for that and also um, ravioli mushroom and I feel like for this bag it cost me $40 but there's not a lot in it so this is one of the things that I bought this is really really nice from Woolies so if you see it it's like on special like two for $12 so I bought like two this one and also a Thai green curry one Anyway, that's it. I'm just gonna continue at home and watching my drama. I will see you guys later. Stay safe, everyone. Bye. Also, this is a video of my fingers and my skins. I always get bad skins during winter. And winter is approaching. Daylight saving is going to be off this weekend. Anyway, see you later. Bye.